everyone and welcome to our epic tip. My name is Anissa and today I'm going to show you how to add an issued policy into epic. So once you're in the client's account and on their policy page, click the plus sign to add. In this example, we'll be adding an auto policy. Please note you'll never have to adjust these blue radio dials. They are already defaulted for you. So you can click the drop down next to type to look for that policy type, or we can type in the code. You can add a description to the policy. and add the policy number. Next, update the effective and expiration dates accordingly. And then take a look at your structure. That should already be pre-filled for you, along with the line of business. Make sure the appropriate profit center has been selected for the policy. Add the issuing company for this policy. We'll use Progressive. Then always check the default commission agreement box. As you can see, once I check that box, a percentage pulled up. If you check that box and nothing displays in the percentage field, you may need to double check and make sure you selected the right issuing company and the right policy line type. Lastly, add in the premium and calculate. Once that's been done, go ahead and click Finish. An activity has been generated indicating that we just added an auto policy for our client. You want to keep this activity open because you want to make sure the policy has been downloaded from the carrier. So select a follow-up start date, 24 to 48 hours out. So remember, this means this activity is going to display on my home screen in Epic the day I tell it to, and I'm going to add a note so I know exactly what I need to do. I added a note to confirm that the policy has been issued and changed by the download. Once I've done all that, I'll click Finish. Now we can see our effective policy has been added into Epic. When you're following up on your download, you're going to come into the Policy page and check the Service Summary row. The area you're going to focus on is the stage of the policy and the changed or entered by. You'll know a policy has been downloaded if the stage says issued and changed or entered by the download. Please use the policies in process submitted suspended report and the daily policies received report to help you follow up on your downloads as well. If you follow up on your download, and the stage of the policy is still in process, check Suspense. If the download is not in Suspense, please request another download from the carrier. If the policy has been issued and changed by the download, close out that follow-up on the download activity. And that's how you add an issued policy into Epic.